awake. <laughs> I'm awake. Oh, you're so cute. Alexa, turn on my Christmas tree. Okay. Cut in. Oh. Good morning, everyone. Welcome back to Vlogmas Day 4. <laughs> I don't even know if I had a day 3. <laughs> Lewis has tied a ribbon around his penis. <laughs> <laughs> Bye. Not Lewis waking up and cleaning the kitchen. Oh, what a vibe. The sausages are in the oven. The candle's been lit. If you saw yesterday's vlog, you'll know that me and Lewis each have one of these calendars. But we can't open them every day. And it's really annoying me because I want to open it. So they just want to know what's inside. But they're only 12 day calendars. And who? 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 The 12 days of Christmas. But who, who on earth designs a calendar? Like, I get it, because they're expensive calendars, but who? Are you a fucking owl? Who? Who, who, who are you? <laughs> what are you, Jordan, a fucking owl? Why, what's the point in that? <laughs> I look so pretty today. I just think everyday Vlogmas is gonna be like another day of me getting cuter. Guys, it's happening. Me and Lewis have started watching um, all the Harry Potters. We're currently on the Prisoner of Azkaban, but we did in fact fall asleep halfway through, so we're just gonna watch it while we have breakfast, and then we'll be back on track. So it turns out we put the wrong one on. We're not actually on the, what did I say we were on? Prisoner of Azkaban. We're not on Prisoner of Azkaban. We're on Chamber of Secrets. We're a little bit further than this, so we're gonna skip a bit further in and then watch it while we have sausage sandwiches for our breakfast. I don't know why my apartment's so dark, but we're all dressed and ready, as you can see, and he's put my coat on. But we're gonna go into town, and we're gonna try and find Lucy's brother a little Christmas present, and then potentially, maybe, having a party. Not here, though, we're not having a party here. Potentially having a party at Lucy's house. But I'm all dressed and ready. We've literally <clears throat> been watching Harry Potter all day long. It's now like half past three. We're gonna go into town. I'm starving, so probably gonna grab something to eat. My energy levels are dipping. We've got on to, what Harry Potter are we on? Goblet of Fire? Goblet of Fire, yeah. We're on Goblet of Fire. I literally would love to stay in all night and all day and watch Harry Potter. We must commence Christmas. I feel Woo! like Scrooge. <laughs> We're just coming to TK Maxx. I mean, where are we? Home sense. Look at how much wrapping paper that is. That is like a normal wrapping paper. Who on earth has this much to wrap? You're bloody joking. Oh, that's cute. Oh, that's cute. I like that. Very nice. Spoiler alert, if any of your family watch <laughs> this, this is all that Lewis is wrapping your presents in. It reminds me of like Home Alone, do you know when you have like a full, like oh, full yeah, set? Little village, oh, I'd love to be, as an old man, I want to be the old man that has this and then all the, oh that it's sounds a bit creepy. An tree I guess all the side. kids in my estate come and look at it, but that seems very, um, very peculiar. Oh, look at that, a little glass, little glass green hairs. I was just saying to Lou, I'd love to get myself like a little Christmas candle, but then I feel like I wouldn't use it all before, like, but that's so cute, like, I love the little jar as well. I don't think I'd actually burn it in time, and then I'd just be stuck with a Christmas candle. And I also don't know what I'd want my house to smell like. Anna has the most incredible Christmassy smelling house, but I just don't know what scent. Hers is very, like, cinnamony, but I don't know if I'm a fan of cinnamon. Like, I can't imagine waking up to the smell of cinnamon. I well, that doesn't smell like Christmas. I want one that smells like Christmas just for an evening when I want it to smell like Christmas, but not all the time. Do you know what I mean? Lewis is a real man on a mission. I can't show you the um, trolley because it does ruin everyone's Christmas presents. But let me tell you, the shopping trolley is getting full, girls. Ooh, Harry Potter game. Not me watching Harry Watch Potter. Oh, now I'm like, like, yeah. <laughs> I'm like, oh Harry my God, Potter. Harry Potter. Right, I've left Lewis to fend for himself and think of Christmas presents. I am looking for some cushions for my sofa because I would love to put the cushions on my bed on my sofa, but then my bed looks bare. And then if I do it the other way, and my sofa looks bare. I've not got enough bloody cushions. So here I am in the cushion aisle trying to find. I love festive cushions, but then it's just like, where do you put them? Like, I'd love a festive candle. I'm not going to use it in time. I'd love a festive mug. Got no room in my cupboard. <laughs> Shut up, mate. It's a bloody joke. Right, everyone, so we've literally just got back home from town. My nose is bright red, it's absolutely freezing cold, which I know you wouldn't really expect anything less when we've come into December. There's no messing around with Lewis, he's straight up into uh, wrapping his yeah. presents. This is wrapping paper you got. I can show this, right? You can't yeah. see what oh, it is. Look at that, much perfect like that. Ooh, Lewis is straight back home, straight wrapping his presents. When I say we've literally just walked through the door, I mean like my hands are still freezing cold from being outside, my nose is still red. I'm gonna make us hot chocolates, and then we are an unexpected turn to this little vlogmas moment. We are in fact having a bit of a would you say it's a party 
Bit of a gathering. Bit of a gathering. Basically, everyone is going over to Lewis's tonight for some drinks. Probably play some board games and stuff. But yeah, that's happening this evening. So you'll probably see everyone this evening if I actually film. It is predominantly going to be filled with Lewis's friends, which are now my friends as well. But I feel awkward vlogging in front of Lewis's side of the friendship. So we'll see if I film anything. I'm going to force myself to because yesterday's vlog, just watching it back, it was six minutes, babes. What the hell is that with that? Um, right. What? What is the stitchy with this? It says three teaspoons. I hope this is nice. If this is nice, then I'm going to replace my morning tea with um, hot chocolate. Did you say Queen? Lewis is actually mocking me because I've apparently come back from London saying Queen. I feel like, personally, in my humble opinion, I said Queen before I actually left for London last week. But apparently, according to Lewis... Yeah, not ev every sentence. Every sentence, it's Queen. Queen shit. Which one do you want? The dopey mug or dad's bro? I don't hate it, actually. I do like it actually. Basically, Louis wants to get an aftershave, but I love the smell of his current aftershave. So, I am the seal of approval. Blup, blup. <laughs> Ooh. Too hot. You know what it smells like? Oh. Um, after eight. Ooh, that is quite good actually. Mm. That's a big bit of chocolate. Tell me you're gay without telling me you're gay. That's rocked really well. Ooh la la, Baldwin. No, that. that is so good, what the hell? Every last ounce of what of you that could be potentially be straight is now <laughs> being lifted. And um, pure homosexual from here on out. I thought I were a good rapper. I'm just a bald. Pull up in the monster automobile gangster. No, you can't open it. Right, we're all dressed and ready to go over to Lewis's. And we've realized basically the 12 day calendars. The 12 day calendars, how are we gonna do it is, we're gonna open one every other day. So we still get like up to Christmas Eve, but the next day that we can open is tomorrow. And we've got number three on these calendars that we're yet to open. It's a very different shape to the first two that we got. I feel like it'll be more fun tomorrow because realistically, what are we doing tomorrow? This is a little exciting thing for tomorrow. So do we open it and knock it into a bag? But it's such a faff taking it all. Look at all the bags we've got to take. But I'm going to have to Uber back. I don't know. Monday. Yeah. <laughs> You're not gonna drop me back. <laughs> Would you think if we opened it and then just put a bag there and knocked no, it in? No, it's fun to like. Ooh. We'll just take what on. No. <laughs> what else you got? Your backpack. The old guy going oh, for oh, it. Bless you. Your backpack <laughs> and this bag. <laughs> All right. What's more of a fact? Close your eyes, <laughs> open them, put them in a bag. <laughs> All right. Fine. Whatever you fucking say. <laughs> <laughs> right, this is the game we're playing. Let's drink to that. It is a Ring of Fire version, I think. Oh no, there's three of us. Oh, three. 